Welcome to Vlogmas Day 4! Hey guys! So we are going grocery shopping. It's 8 o'clock and my sister is here. We're going to go pick up my other sister. And it's going to be a sister day full of um, shopping. I have a day off. Um, obviously. <laughs> I have almost every day off. Lock the door. Make sure I have my keys. That is Bailey. She doesn't want me to leave. Anyways, we are going to go and shop for food. I have, ouch, my reusable bags. And this is so great, is that Carl likes the Cherry Glacier Gatorade. Um, and it's 10 for 10. And here he has like eight of them, but because it's on sale, you know, he says go get more. So the wine bag this lady gave me one time put Gatorade in it. I'm like, oh my gosh, that's such a good idea. So I'm gonna go just go get four Gatorades, but I'm gonna put them in this wine thing. It's so nice. I don't have to shit carry them in this thing. Okay, I gotta get going though, because my sister is waiting for us and I'm gonna be the cause of that wait. Go figure. Thank you, Debbie. in my parking lot in my driveway trying to carry as many groceries as I can at once um so shopping went well my lane froze I, that's how much of good luck I have um hold on trying to do this <laughs> at one time Whew. so um not bad, not bad. I had to get diapers for Debbie. And then, um, one thing of milk. Carl's going to take this chicken, and he's gonna buy some steak, and he's gonna grill it, and then I'll have it for the week, so like I'm meal prepping some of my meats. So, um, I'll have it for the week just to add in to stuff, and that's just one less thing I have to worry about, and it tastes so much better. I just love grilled chicken, so. When I said to Carl, I'm getting bored, he's like, listen, let me grill. Oh yeah, he'll grill out in snow. Like, he grilled out for Christmas last year. Uh, Michiganders don't care. So, now I just gotta go and, oh yeah. So I get bananas that look like this on purpose, obviously. And every time I go there, the same cashier, she's like, okay, I discounted your bananas because I don't know why they keep them out like that. I'm like, okay, thanks. I don't wanna tell her that. Um, I go on purpose to get these. I'll take discounted bananas. Yay for me. Hey guys, so I am carrying all sorts of stuff to the garage. Hold on, let me... Yeah, that's my pizza box. Oh, oh gosh. to do everything in one swoop. This is not a good angle, but you already know I'm fat. So I'm putting my loaf of bread in the freezer. That way I save it and I don't waste. Because remember guys, oh, yesterday I was talking about how much I wasted. That is not like me. So, okay. So we have like tons of this pop in here and I put the um, pop in here just because well, obviously, I was like, it stays cold, we don't keep opening the thing, and when people come over, whatever. Okay, so I'm putting my chicken in here because he's on grill tomorrow, and I just don't want it in my fridge taking up room. And then four more Gatorades that I he already has, um, like eight of them in here or something, nine, ten. Yeah. 
But this is what I wanted to show you guys. So, last couple days, bam, I ordered um, Domino's Pizza yesterday. I'm putting it in here. Let me just use the fridge light for a second. No, I won't. You don't want to keep that open. I'll just go outside and freeze my ass off. Oh, right here is fine. Oh my gosh, my left arm hurts because I just carried all that stuff in. Um, so I just took a piece of pizza. Don't, no, wait, let me finish. I ate a piece of pizza because I am starving. I had some yogurt this morning. It is 9.30, my stomach is hungry. It's 350 calories per slice. That is less than I would eat for breakfast. My breakfast tends to be around 500 to 400. Um, so including the yogurt and stuff, that is almost 500 calories. So I'll take it. And why I did it, because I, I wanted it. It was in my fridge when I was unpacking. I saw it. I wanted pizza. And I told myself, well, you know, just eat the pizza today and just start over tomorrow, you know, blah, blah. But I can't do that. I can't. I have to fight. I have to learn to cope. And I'm not getting angry at you. I'm getting angry at myself. And so what I did is I took one slice because I know I wanted it. So I gave myself that one slice. I put the pizza in here. I got what I wanted. And one slice of a 350 calorie pizza is not going to kill my day. It's almost 4 o'clock and I'm going to have a snack. And I want to uh, eat some pretzel thins. And like I said before, these are like only 100 calories for 11. So I do count them just because it's portion size. One, two, three, four, five, six. And I come coming to you. And just one more. And then of course the 12th one. For good luck, you know. Hi, babe. Hi. Score, I was able to renew both of the Lauren Graham books and um, The Subtle Art of Not Giving a Fuck, that was my book. Um, that was the one I was really on the waiting list because it's so popular. So I got three extra weeks um, with them and time to get reading. So, yay, I'm happy. I just love the library. It's like one of my favorite places, and I, I just love that I'm getting back into um, reading, so. And that Debbie is a little older, she doesn't constantly need me. Oh, if you're a mom, remember those breastfeeding days? Every two hours, just on the tit, on the tit. Anyways, I'm just happy. So this is what I'm having with some rice. Mm -mm -mm. Looks delicious. Dinner was actually very tasty, very filling. Um, I'm glad today I looked on the positive side and I'm happy that I only had that one slice of pizza and I haven't even thought about it in just until now because I'm looking back on how my day was. And I'm just happy of the decisions I made and I just need to keep focusing on that and keep being able to say no because I'm always going to have that want um but I need to I know I need to di direct my brain differently if that even makes sense so yeah I'm happy with what I did today um I don't know how many calories I ate so obviously I'm not calorie counting but I'm happy with um with what I ate uh and I got a lot of veg uh, a lot of veggies in today so happy about that but I am now having to clean my kitchen which is not that bad because I mean I had a wrap um what did I have for breakfast oh yeah that pizza see oh you forgot um yeah so I don't have that many dishes to do which is nice when you can have like a one pot dish I'm sweating guys I'm sweating because I'm fat and when I have to move around a lot you know obviously Girl gets a lot of sweat. Um, anyways, don't ask me what that was about. I'm sorry. That was stupid. Uh, yeah. I don't know really what to say right now because 
I'm just so excited that I did well today. But at the same time, it's just like, oh my gosh, how many times have I this year, guys, keep restarting and restarting? And I know it's okay. I know that it's better to keep doing that than waiting for months and months to not restart. But, I don't know, it just gets to you a little bit, you know? Like, ugh, you failed again. But I have to believe in myself, and I have to stay positive. So that's what I'm going to be doing. But I'm going to read The Subtle Art of Not Giving a Fuck. And apparently, <laughs> and the thing says, uh, let's not think positive right now. Uh, in, the, in the description of the thing. Well, it doesn't say that per se. Let me see what it says. It says... For decades, we've been told that positive thinking is the key to a happy, rich life. But, but, you see how my eyes are? But, but those days are over. Fuck positivity. North Manson says, let's be honest. Sometimes things are fucked up and we have to live with it. Yep, we, we certainly do. We certainly do. Um, but I don't have to live with, uh, this unhealthiness, I can change it. So that's what I will be doing. And I want to thank every single one of you for being here. I'm really tired. Uh, but yeah, overall, I'm really happy with this. Anyways, this has been so long. My videos are so long. I'm so sorry, guys. You're like, ugh, what? Why did she always have long videos? I'll try to shorten them. I promise. But anyways, I'm going to leave it here tonight. And I'm going to do my dishes. But I hope every one of you guys um, has a good night. Oh, but first, let's, um, sorry, there's something in my eye. Hit the uh, like button if you like this video. And subscribe if you have not. And obviously, I hope every single one of you guys have a good morning, afternoon, or night, wherever your little souls are at. Bye, healthy buddies. I can't open it and show you guys just in case Ashley is watching.